hello everyone welcome back again to my channel my name is Lydia and I hope you all are doing well and in this video I'll be sharing with you how to make Ghana Ekwegwemi very simple and delicious it's made of corn with the skin removed and it's eating as breakfast so I hope you will enjoy this recipe so let's get started and also don't forget to subscribe like and share if you enjoyed this recipe so without wasting much time let's get started I have here two cups of maize that has been broken into smaller tiny pieces and I'll be soaking it in water for about one hour before we continue cooking so in another bowl I'm going to transfer the maize and add some water to it and I'm going to soak it for about one hour to be soft before we start cooking. So it's been soaking for one hour. And next I'm going to go ahead and wash and rinse it before we cook it. Now in another saucepan I'm going to add in some water. And I'll wait for it to boil before I transfer the maize into it. So now transfer the ekwe grain into the water and I'll give it a stir. So this should be cooking on the medium to low heat. And you have to be stirring it continuously. And as it keeps um, cooking, it will thicken up. And once it's thicken up, you can add more water until it's nice and soft. So it has begun to thicken up. Now keep stirring it. Next I'll add in half a teaspoon of salt. Now keep stirring it again. And at this point, I'll add in another water. Now keep stirring it. And at this point, I'm going to add in about half a cup of bread flour. And I'm going to mix it with water and add it to the ekwegwemi. It's totally optional. But 
but once you add it it gives the equigwemi very nice texture nice and fluffy texture So I'm going to add it to it and I'll keep stirring. And as you can see, it's very nice and thick and fluffy. So you keep stirring until it's cooked very well. And at this point our equigwemi is all done, looking so nice. Yeah, so it's all done and I'm going to add in my sugar and my milk. You can also enjoy it with some peanuts, bread. Yeah, thank you all so much for watching and I hope you have enjoyed this recipe and don't forget to give me a like, subscribe and share and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!